Hi guys, today I'll be talking about the height levels of your strikes. We have three levels, low, medium, and high. So when we're doing our polygonal targeting system for the tetragon, we have four targets there, the four sides of the diamond, which is one, two, three, and four. Most beginning students would confuse striking number one by doing this strike, like this. And when you do this strike, let me show that to you here. When, when you're doing this strike, yeah, you actually hit number one, but the problem is you're doing the angle wrong. It's like doing number two. So that's why I want to emphasize or explain to you the height levels of your strikes. So when we're doing number one, it should be going up. So, in the case of Balampas, the strike should be going up. For a pitik, the strike should be going up. For number two, it should be going down. Number three is going down. Number four is going up. So, where does the height level come in? So, when we're doing number one, we can target the knee or the leg, right? But, we're not limited to targeting the knee or the, the leg because we can also do a strike number one to the weapon hand, which is at the middle level. Or the head, which is at the higher level. Same thing goes with number two. When we're targeting the shoulder, we can also target the weapon hand at the middle level. Or the leg, or the knees. With number three, usually we target the head or the shoulder, but we can also target the, the knees. The knees, even the foot. So this is low, middle, and high strikes. With number four, this is low, middle, and high. So coming from, from number one, this is a low strike. This is a middle strike, this is a high strike. Coming from number two, this is high, middle, and then low. Coming from number three is high, middle, low. Number four is low, middle, and high. So that's what I meant by the height levels of your strikes. You can be doing number one in any levels, but they're all basically Strike number one. And number two, you can be doing a very low strike, but basically they're all number two. Same with number three. And number four. When you're doing a lampas, and you're doing a low strike with the lampas with the number one, the point of impact is very low. Point of impact will probably be at the knees. See? And when you're doing a middle strike, the point of impact would be at the weapon hand level. And the high strike would be, the point of impact would be very high. Okay? Same with number two. Point of impact when you're doing a high strike is very high. And when you're doing a middle strike, point of impact is in the middle. When we're doing a low strike, point of impact is very, very low. And it applies to number three and also number four. Let me show that. High, middle, low. Number four, low, middle, high. So I hope you learned something today about the levels of strikes. And when I say levels of strikes, it's not the skill level, it's the height level. Low, middle, and high. Low, middle, high. So that's how you do your strikes.